Well, after some breezy conditions for today, in fact, the last couple of days, we are going to see those winds start to diminish for tonight and as we're heading into the weekend. We could see some flurries possible and some colder air that's going to return. But we did see a lot of sunshine, especially into southeast Iowa or into northeast Missouri. A lot of cloudy skies into southeast Iowa, and that really put a damper on the temperatures. A little bit warmer with that sun peeking through. But we are going to continue with uh, partly cloudy skies and a very slight chance that we could see a few flurries uh, from a couple moving system, fast moving systems that's moving through, especially over southeast Iowa as we're heading into tonight, Saturday, and possibly into Sunday. So it's just about a 20% chance uh, that we'll see some flurries, and that is just about it. Uh, no snow accumulation is expected. Temperature-wise, uh, some locations saw a little bit warmer than others because of those cloudy skies. Uh, over the next 24 to 48 hours, we are going to see some colder air filtering back in. This is around 7 in the morning into the mid to upper 20s, and then around 1 o'clock into the lower 30s, and actually topping out into the upper 30s for tomorrow uh, before we continue to kind of move southward as far as those temperatures. 46 degrees right now with mostly clear skies at the Kirksel Regional Airport. Winds are still brisk out of the west at 13 miles per hour. Dew point 24 and relative humidity levels at 42 percent. A little bit colder in Atoma, 35 degrees north-northwest winds, 7 miles per hour. Dew point 25 and relative humidity levels at 67 percent. Big temperature difference because of those cloudy skies that stuck around into southeast Iowa only into the mid-30s right now, but Macon coming in at 49 degrees. Overnight lows for tonight around 24 degrees with partly cloudy skies. Northwest winds around 5 to 10 miles per hour. Community calendar event for tomorrow. It is the Adair County Mobile Food Pantry that's going to be held at the uh, Hamilton Street Baptist Church in Kirksville starting at 11 a.m. Temperatures about 34 degrees with partly sunny skies. And then topping out into the upper 30s around 38 degrees. Northwest winds 5 to 10 again. Could see a few flurries for Saturday as well as into a Sunday. Sunday about 10 degrees colder, 28 degrees partly sunny skies, 15 degrees Sunday night. And then some colder air filtering in for next week. Monday 28 degrees with mostly cloudy skies and a 20% chance of light snow. 10 degrees Monday night, 21 both on Tuesday and Wednesday. But overnight lows back down into the single digits Tuesday night around 6 degrees. And then mostly sunny skies on Wednesday, 21. Of course, you can get your forecast 24-7 at heartlandconnection.com. So once again, Here we, we do have that cold again. Arctic front that's going to move in and then to bring temperatures into the single digits as overnight lows next week. We've been up and down so much, you'd think we'd get used to it. But you I would don't think, think we so, do. but we got spoiled a few days of yeah. those temperatures into the 40s mm -hmm. and now back to reality. Here we go. Yes. All right. Thanks, Teresa.